Hey there, uh, I am recording again today with 1080p only here with my camera and we're gonna see how we uh, do this, how we um, send a video from an iPhone here, iPhone 12, a photo or a video, how do we send this over to the PC. So let me take a quick video here, here's my PC everything and here on the side is the USB let's zoom in there is the USB connection and then take a photo there and then we can do a slow motion thing quick slow mo okay Right, so those images are on here now on the phone, and I never use this laptop here with with an Apple device. So for me, it's a first. Let's we'll see how easy this is. I'm gonna try to oh, the plug's in there. Um, is this thing locked in? Um, the thing is. Um, Let's plug this in here. Let's see what happens. We heard a noise. Allow this device to access photos and videos. Allow. On this side and here, autoplay, iPhone, whatever. So now if you click here on the file explorer, I have an icon here. I'm getting a message at the same time. Sorry, I'll put this here. So then we see if the Apple iPhone is in here, and we see this here, Apple iPhone, here. Select to choose what happens with this device. We go in there, open the device to view files there. So automatically it opens it. And then we see I have 82 gigabyte available of 238 on the phone. Double click on it and there is nothing in it. Right. And then most likely you have to reconnect it, uh, disconnect it for the first time, and then reconnect it. Do you allow this? Yes. So we allow it. And then here, double click. Now we have a photo folder. Go in there, and then this is sorted by date here, sort and view, we go into the view thing here, view, there's details, let's do that, it's 2022 and this is 2021 12, so that was December, and this is 2022 01, and then there is a bunch of files in here, so let's go here again to uh, details, and then we basically have here the time when this was uh, taken and then today at 10.35 this is one, let's open this open it with photos okay <laughs> I said wait to see what this is so this is the picture I took I don't know what this is this is different photos from oh I from the same phone so this is photos now looking on the phone in this folder of the phone to see how they look like. Accident here in this upright format. Look, this was a video. Can we zoom in here over more? Yeah, I took a picture out my window this morning. Okay, there's one movie file. We can here sort by type. There's a bunch of movie files in here. And, uh, I don't know what this movie is. Movie player, right? Now, I'm recording in 4K60 on this phone. And this laptop is only 1080p. So this is going to choke on this 
There is no question. Let's turn this off. We have a 50 uh, gigabyte, but I can take it from here and drag it onto my desktop if I wanted to. And then you see how it copies. So let's go here to a JPEG file. Here, this is a seven megabyte JPEG file. Let's put this over here. Then if I open it from my computer, then I can see the picture I took this morning on there. So it's relatively easy to get those pictures of your iPhone over to your Windows 11. This is Windows 11. This is the cheapest laptop I could find with Windows 11 installed already. Um, you can see my unboxing video here. That I have a playlist with everything about this laptop. And uh, yeah, so you can look into this playlist if you want to see more videos about this cheapest laptop I could find for Windows 11. And I don't know where I bought this. This is a USB C to um, USB C to Lightning, the Apple thing here, right? Now, I heard that the European government is forcing Apple to go with USB-C on this. But I don't know what happens on this cheapest laptop. So I have one uh, Lightning to USB-C that came from Costco. Let me turn this back on. And then let's see if that works. There is a USB-C in here. It does something, yeah? Look at that. So USB-C also works. It wants me to trust this again. Okay, that's fine. Apple iPhone here. Open up. Folder. That was 2021. Here's 20. Uh, 20 whatever. Okay, let's do by list. And then this was the last one. As you can see, this works the same way with USB-C on here. USB-C to through the lightning cable, right? So this came from Costco. Here. Yeah. It's a long one. Okay, yeah, I hope that helped you. Here, there is an exclamation mark. Now the device was either stopped responding or had been disconnected. Yes, we disconnected it. 100%. Okay, yeah, so I have my files on here if I need it. Very easy. Thanks for watching, and I see you in my next video.